A logo is displayed, depicting six blind cane-holding figures, arranged in a pinwheel pattern in the colors of orange, blue, and green. They sit atop the words, National Federation of the Blind of Nebraska. Live the life you want. Hello, my Nebraska friends and family. This is Scott Labar, president of your Western neighbor affiliate, the National Federation of the Blind of Colorado. And, you know, the National Federation of the Blind, for me, has continued to change my life. And I guess one of the greatest things that it has given me, among so many others, is a true sense of family and community. And one of my most vivid memories goes back a little over 18 years ago. We were having our first son, Alexander, who is now 18. And in fact, he was born on October 4th, 2002. And that also happened to be the weekend of the National Federation of Blind of Colorado's annual convention. Alexander was born on a Friday afternoon. And it was very dramatic because we had to go through an emergency c-section and after everything was settled and so on and so forth i called one of my friends in the federation and it happened to be kevin worley and i told kevin about alexander and that he was doing great and he had just been born and kevin repeated that message to the meeting he was in it was some breakout session and the whole room erupted in cheers and clapping and they everybody was sending me their love and good wishes and it just really touched me and that's that's what we are in the national federation of the blind one big wonderful family have a great convention greetings fellow federationists my name is linda mentink I joined the Federation while living in Wisconsin in 1975. I have attended every national convention since 1986 and two before then. I have heard over the years names of people living in Nebraska. I moved here in 2004 and joined the senior division in 2015 where I met many of those people to go with the names that I heard. One of the things I most enjoy in life is meeting new people and I have enjoyed getting to know and becoming good friends with the people in the senior division here in Nebraska. Hi, this is Shelley Duffy. You knew me as Shelley Johns. I'd like to share three memories real quickly if I can do it in 30 seconds. I remember two things about the White Cane Banquet of 1996. Angie was just a baby, and I was assigned to talk about games for the blind, and I had a deck of cards in my hands on the podium, and I dropped them all on the floor, and everybody laughed about my 52-card pickup game. Secondly, that same night, we learned that Mike Johns left locked the keys in the van, so while we waited, you all passed Angie around. She is now about to get her second degree, her first degree is in biology pre-med and her second will be in nursing. The last memory I have is of the, um, oh, what do you call it? The rally, the, not the rally, the um, demonstration, the picketing that we did to have the commission be a separate entity in uh, 1998. We were all out there on the lawn of the state house, I believe it was, chanting and cheering, Ben, use the pen, or sign the dotted line, or something that we did. So those are my memories. I really miss you guys. The preceding presentation was brought to you by the National Federation of the Blind of Nebraska. Live the life you want.